All right, so let's jump in and look at a tool called iEspionage. Um, this tool pulls all of their landing pages from uh, ad copy that's being run on search. Um, you can also pretty much assume though that if, if a marketer or a brand is running ads via search, um, they're probably using the same landing pages and perhaps even the same ad copy uh, in their social media advertising or network advertising as well. So uh, once you log in and uh, start searching away, you can see there's competitive research and landing page gallery. Uh, competitor research, you can just type in the name of any um, competitor you'd like to track. And you can see the keywords they're using, um, the ads they're running. And again, these are just AdWord type ads, so they won't have uh, display pictures, but it's great to see what messaging they, they might be using. I'd pay attention to this AEI ads effectiveness index, which basically is just a score um, based on how long they've been running the ads. And the longer they've been running the ads, the more likely um, it's performing and it's converting ads to the landing page it's directing to. Um, so for some reason, when you click on landing pages, it doesn't always populate here. Although you can see, for example, this, this example, you can see their competitors. One way to get around that is to click on the destination URL and you can open that in another window. So this AEI score is fairly good. Um, could be better and we can find some better ones, um, but it's probably converting some leads, right? I bet it's been running for so long. I'm the co-founder and CEO of the- so You can check out that landing page there and all the other ones with the other associated ads. Um, and then again, you can see the competitors populated right in um, the tool here. And then maybe if you're lucky, you'll see the, the brand you searched as well. So the other cool thing that iEspionage has is this uh, landing page gallery. And let's call it a landing page gallery uh, lightly because I think what that means is it's a page that um, is being directed to from an advertisement. So um, that might mean that people are directing their ads directly to a website. So it has just um, standard websites in here as well. Um, but the cool thing about this is that you can uh, view by um, industry. So you can get some inspiration that way which is pretty cool. And then the other thing you can do too, is if you're trying to judge, you know, is this landing page converting? Is it high performing? Do I want to try it for my own brand? Um, for example, if I, if I like this CenturyLink uh, landing page, I could go back to the competitor research, type in that brand there and see uh, what their ad effectiveness score is as well. So you can get some more detail by looking across industries. Um, I'd also encourage you to look outside of your own industry just for some inspiration and see what landing pages uh, might be working. So here you can see this is a very high AEI score. Um, so if we go to this landing page, we can probably bet that this is, is highly uh, high converting. So we might pay attention to what content they're promoting, if it's a freemium or resource, or how they're positioning their solution, um, how they're positioning their content above the fold, what their call to action um, is, what type of imagery or style they're using. So many things that you can um, think about for your own landing pages. So that's I Espionage. Hope it's helpful.